thing each of these teams can do is pass the rock, Grant. We should see a lot of ball movement tonight. Hey, sharing is caring. And of course, there's great chemistry on both teams. There's such a flow to this game when they get together. And we're going to see some terrific team basketball tonight. I can't wait. All right, check it out. Golden State's opening lineup. The core of the Warriors dynasty on the floor. Curry and Clay is the guards with Draymond at the four. Andrew Wiggins is out there with Kevon Looney. Now Los Angeles with it. Here's Reddish. After missing his first attempt, now one for two. And so Curry will bring it up for Golden State. Pass to Green. And here is Thompson. Reddish covering. Back to Green. Another shot. And it's blocked by Davis. Reddish against Thompson. And the layup is good off the glass. Reddish has got his second bucket on the night. Man, he's bringing the energy, the efficiency. I love what he's doing offensively. Well, Clark, we often note the offensive impact from Davis. But he also gets it done on the other end of the floor. He is the best defender in the league in my mind when you look at all the aspects of playing defense. He's a multiple block shot champ. His anticipation and timing at the defensive end on top shelf. Now here's Davis. His last outing, we saw him score 22. Six on the shot clock. Here's Reddish. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Well, the Lakers moved from Inglewood to this downtown arena back in 99. This place has been special, Clark. Some all-time moments here, B.A. Kobe's 81-point game comes to mind. LeBron setting the all-time NBA scoring record. All those classic Shaq, Kobe playoff games. A few titles sprinkled in there as well. Special indeed. The first one falls for him. And with a single punch in last season's training camp, it seems the Warriors' culture of joy and togetherness really took a hit, Grant. You know, I agree, B.A., and that's what they need to recover from. You know, keeping that connection and commitment to a common purpose is so crucial to winning. Well, there's no question that the Warriors are the team of the decade, Grant. Oh, I mean, B.A., think about it. Six finals appearances in eight years. They did miss the playoffs in two of those seasons, but they still came away with four championship rings, plus two MVP trophies. Not bad. Now, here is James. You just have to discipline yourself not to fall for James pump fake because as soon as he gets you up in the air, you're done. Second team foul. At the line for Los Angeles, LeBron James. He's off on the first. Look, the physicality has always stood out with LeBron. It's been obvious, but his basketball IQ is what makes him such a special, special player. I mean, he sees the game like very few ever have. And the second free throw is good. Well, as we've seen throughout the history of the Lakers, Clark, it's a big free agent and trade destination. Well, I think part of it is the weather attraction. I mean, guys love playing where the weather is always nice. Not to mention to be with the team whose goal is to win championship. And when you see Wiggins starting to develop that mindset, that mental edge, knows he has the defender in trouble, and he's able to draw the foul as a result. Free throw drops for Wiggins. You know, it's interesting. Some people say Wiggins should play meaner, but to me, the most important thing is that he improves his overall game every year. He's off on the second. 
The Lakers have gone two of three from the floor. Here's James. Ooh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. So physically powerful. A tough task to defend LeBron inside. At the line for Los Angeles, LeBron James. And the first one at the line is good. And over a long regular season, Graham, what are some of the things coaches do to keep things fresh and their players engaged? Well, you said it best. It is a long season. And to keep it light, you have to have team outings and, and dinners and guest speakers. Intentional connections, that's what I call it. And really, there's so much pressure in this league. So those moments only allow you to bond and relax and really come together as a group. Now a timeout called by Golden State. Yeah, hoping to tap into something that'll get them clicking. Yeah, and you know, that's going to be the focus of this timeout. They need to come up with a spark to get the offense going. Let's go. The Warriors have gone one of five to start things off. Here's Curry. Here's Looney. And he buries his first look. That'll drive your coach crazy, failing to box out. Ugh, those are free points you're giving away. You've got to work harder on the glass. And the call is going to be yes on an illegal screen. Well, the league has put an emphasis to crack down on illegal screens. Yeah, you know, he might have gotten away with that a few years ago, but not anymore. No way. Now you've got to be stationary on those screens. No extra hips or elbows, or they'll call it. Golden State has gone one or two from three-point land so far. Curry looking it over. Rejected by James. What timing by James on the denial. His hand is right there at the exact moment it needs to be. And he's going for the oop here. Oh, what a nice defensive play to disrupt the lob. Here's Curry. James with the rebound. A rare miss for him at point blank range. That's one he'd like to have back. Pass to Reeves. Who poked away? James against Curry. And there's a minute 45 left in the first quarter of the game. Takes the three. Finally gets one to go. That makes him one for five in this game. It looks easy, effortless. Curry, natural from long range. The Lakers call timeout. Now they put up a nice win against Chicago last timeout. They were lights out from beyond the arc, and they spaced the floor beautifully in that one. There's all kind of talk in the game today about stretching the floor, because when you do that, everything else just becomes a little easier. And the Lakers will go for a different look here. Christian Wood is checked in for Davis. Vanderbilt comes in for James. Hachimura is checked in for Prince. And Russell is subbed in for Reeves. Now here's Wood. He's been productive, averaging just over seven points a game. Just three to shoot. Pass to Reddish. And he banks in the layup. Reddish has got eight. The Warriors trailing. To the right side. Here's Jackson Davis, guarded by Wood. And obviously a total team player. Sharich is a guy, if his teammate is open, he's going to get the ball. And the Lakers with possession here. Left side, Russell. And that one's good. Pounding it inside early and often, setting a physical tone. Let's see if they want to go two for one here, Grant. Hey, looking at the clock, I'd say yes. From the low block. Again, Golden State. And the Lakers with possession here. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. Russell to pass to Reddish. 
And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Grab that one. However, so far, they're getting a little out-hustled on the boards. And because it's still early, I wouldn't read too much into it. There's still a lot of game left. Tie game in Los Angeles. Don't go away. We'll be back momentarily. Thirteen. The Warriors. Thirteen. Close game underway so far. We'll see if either of these teams can jump out ahead in the second quarter. Taking a look at the Lakers' performance here, guys. What are your thoughts? It's simple. The main takeaway from the first quarter is they're winning this game with defense. Yeah, I agree. I mean, look at the energy, the effort defensively. They put it all out there in that opening quarter. So on the floor for Golden State to kick off the second quarter. Wiggins at the three with Draymond at the four. Then there's Dario Saric, then there's Stephen Curry, and it's Pajemski in at the two. Now Los Angeles with it. Reddish passes to Russell. Takes a 13-footer. He's looking good. Yeah, two yeah, buckets Russell. and three attempts. Okay. Guys, that was really nice work mixing in this shot. When Russell was squared up and shooting with confidence, which is most of the time, he can bury it. Now here's Green. No made basket yet, and they get it back. Curry passes to Wiggins. Just five on the clock. Second chance shot. The shot, no good. Nice D from Reddish. The Lakers in the lead. A chance here to catch up with Alley from the sideline. Draymond Green is one of the most versatile defenders in the league. He said, quote, I'm comfortable guarding anybody. But he also said, I love playing against those big guys. They're thinking they've got a mismatch, but I'm built for this. It won't be as easy as you think it's going to be, right? He always takes that challenge, doesn't he? Thank you. And the Lakers with some changes. Prince has checked in for Achimura, and Reeves is subbed in for Reddish. Here's Curry. Curry creates inside. Hey, inside Curry has all the tricks. Floaters, scoop shots, fall away, left hand, right hand. However he has to do it, he will. Two points. That one goes. Reeves has got his first two points of the night. Watch out now. When this guy gets into a rhythm, it is something to behold. Curry passes to Green. Back to Curry. Green with the ball. Russell covering. It's Wiggins on the wing. Here's Looney. Oh, look at Looney finding space inside. Excellent activity and timing on the offensive glass. That's how you get extra possession. On the wing, Reeves, defended by Thompson. Oh, and plays like that one can make the difference in a close game. And it definitely got the bench on their feet, too. Making a statement for sure. I mean, we'll see if they can maintain that aggressive approach, guys. And so Davis will bring it up for the Lakers. Four-point game. Pass to Reeves. Outside Davis. Russell with the ball. Jacks up a three. Looney grabs a miss. Looney's got four rebounds now. Here's Curry. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. That one on Russell. And we heard some coaches saying the league punishes retaliation. And that might even encourage players to instigate. Grant, you think he's got a point? You know, B.A., I think he does. I mean, if guys are creating a dust-up to try to get opposing star players thrown out, the officials cannot reward that. First free throw is good. And Curry's focus at this point in his career is clear. To keep winning championships. And so Curry nails both of them. Making shots at the line. You need a good routine, and he certainly has one. 
We're just over two and a half minutes into the second. His first shot coming late. Davis can't hit. And just not allowing the shooter to get comfortable from mid-range. As a defender, he's going to just be a bothersome, worrisome guy, making you miserable all night. A hand in your face on every jumper. When they get their opportunity to punch it inside, they don't hesitate. Here's James. And a foul call on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. It's going to go on Draymond Green. Yeah, the defense has to be careful with LeBron. I mean, he's a clever shooter who knows how to draw fouls. He uses his body really well. LeBron James. And he makes a first. And the Lakers making a change here. Vanderbilt's checked in. Both free throws good from James. A minute 58 left in the first half of this game to the wing on the left lets a floater go and here's Kaminga for three and he buries his first look yeah Joseph adept at finding his open teammates and that's exactly what you want from your point guard James inside and he buries his first look so guys I would call that methodical but explosive you know he waits for the opportunity and then boom right to the rack and it's the Lakers on the break. Oh, LeBron hammers it home. Tell you what, just add that one to the highlight reel, James. is truly one of the greatest slam dunkers of all time. Time called here. The Warriors decide to talk it over. Adjustments are a part of every game in every quarter of a game. I think Coach sees something here. And you know what? We'll see what changes he makes coming out of this timeout. Reddish has checked in for Davis. Sharich checks in for the Warriors. Jackson Davis with the Chase bucket. Jackson, Jackson Davis, Davis has got six points. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. 102 left in the second quarter. Here's James. Ooh, LeBron with the slam. How many times have we seen that? I mean, LeBron going right through and into the defense and finds a way to power through the contact as if he hasn't even been hit. You have to love the unselfishness on display there. Excellent pass. Prince against Kaminga. Prince can't hit. If they play this right, they can go two for one. Yeah, they really have to work the clock right now. And here's Thompson for three. And the Warriors with another three. With perfect mechanics, too. Clay Thompson's jumper is a work of art, an all time shooter. Here's James. Wow, some sturdy inside play from LeBron. You can tell he's feeling it. Hasn't missed a single shot all quarter. Thompson against Prince. Back to Thompson. Left side, Kaminga. On the wing, Thompson. Another three for three, Golden State. Thompson. One of the most effortless three, strokes we've ever seen. Thompson can just make corner threes in his sleep. It's not going to go for him. And so a close game as we wrap up the first half of play. Warriors ahead, up by three. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow on 2K Sports. Man, give a big round of applause. And now the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, welcome back to the NBA on 2K Sports. This is Ernie Johnson. Kenny the Jet Smith is right here. Say hey to the folks, Kenny. Hey, folks. Say hey to the yeah, folks, folks, Shaq. Hey, folks. Hey, let's get this party started. Golden State found themselves in a close game in the first. They stayed within arm's reach in that opening period. Five points, their largest deficit. In the second quarter, they put in the work to create a slight scoring advantage. Taking a look at the Warriors, Kenny, what you think? 
you have to love a team that pounds the offensive glass. That's going to gain you extra possession. And check this out. Sometimes just having more offensive chances than your opponent wins the basketball. Shaq, what was your takeaway on the Lakers? I like how they're working the ball down low and finding easy looks. They may be tempted to switch things up in the second half, but I say stick with it and force the other team to adjust to the way you play. That's all for now. Say goodbye to the folks. Thanks goodbye, for folks. joining us. Third quarter, just about ready to begin. As we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard. You know, LeBron James has been exceptional here, guys. And in the first half, he dominated in the post. He got the looks he wanted and was able to execute. Yeah, you know what? I think he's doing exactly what he has to do, using his body, shaking off contact, and then finishing at the rim. It's LeBron at power forward with AD as the center. Austin Reeves out there with Cam Reddish. And it's Prince in at the three. So that's who Darvin Ham starts the second half with. Gives us a chance to catch up with Ali LaForce. The Warriors are pursuing a two-timeline approach, competing for titles while also building a young core for their future. It does not come cheap. This season, they're paying record-high luxury tax with the total team payroll around half a million. Brian, the commitment to winning now and down the road is evident. Deep pocket tally, that's for sure. Thank you. First one falls. Hits one, then misses the second attempt from the line. Pass to Green. LeBron with the rebound. James has got five rebounds in the game. Prince on the attack. Excellent D there from Wiggins. A perfect example of how to protect the rim. And you know, guys, I love his fight and grit on the interior. I mean, he never lets a shot go uncontested. And he drives in. Prince. Oh, it's blocked by Green. Green takes great pride in his defense now. He loves denying shots at the rim and playing bigger than his 6'8 frame would lead you to believe. Outside Curry. Pass to Wiggins. On the wing. Green. Oh, look at Draymond. Flexing with that finish. He drops yet another dime. Just facilitating this offense like a maestro. Well, when you look at the assist totals, they're clearly the better team. And his fantastic performance from the last game has carried over to tonight. And you know that's how it goes with him and me. His hot streaks, guys, don't last minutes. They last days. On the wing, Thompson. The three. The Lakers with a rebound. James has got his sixth rebound on the night. Davis, the pass to Reeves. And he's going for the lob. And the lob disrupted. Not to be. Wiggins finds Looney. And here's Curry for three. Curry splashes it in. This defense just can't stay connected to shooters. The Lakers call timeout. Man, it's been quite a game for Stephen Curry. And I think a new plan would be a good idea. At least make it hard on this guy. Some changes now for the Lakers. Christian Wood is checked in for LeBron. Hachimura comes in for Prince. And Russell is subbed in for Reeves. Pass to Reddish. Here's Davis. The three from Wood. Doesn't go that time. Man, that's his shot. <laughs> Maybe he was too wide open. Here's Green. Wow, Green attacking the rim. 
delicious dime from Curry there. One of the reasons his teammates love playing with him. Now here's Reddish. That one doesn't drop. And so Curry will bring it up for Golden State. They lead by eight. Biggest lead of the game. And now we're three minutes into this third quarter of play. Parky, look at Christian Wood. When he's in the right situation, he's productive. Very much so. You give him minutes and he'll put up numbers. It's that simple. Takes pride in his glass eating and can score from different levels. Russell against Curry. Pass to Wiggins. Here's Pachemski. Nice D from Reddish. Los Angeles has gone one of two shooting from the perimeter since halftime. The putback. Oh, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. You know, I think this is where Wood's activity level is through the roof. He is a monster on the glass. Here's Curry. He's got 14. Wiggins passes to Looney. Back to Wiggins. Six to shoot. And a deep three from Curry. And the Warriors miss again. You know, even though they have the lead, you can tell he's frustrated with himself that he's not doing more. Here's Reddish. Off target with the three. Golden State has got six of 11 threes to go in this game. Pass to Looney. Green against Wood. And it's Green missing. And that's not the look they wanted. The defender was right there. Can't cash it in from close range. Boy, this is um, bad. Tough to watch. I mean, this is really bad. He's stone cold this quarter. Man, it hasn't been his best quarter. I mean, he's trying to shoot himself out of the slump. The three from Russell. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Wiggins got his fourth rebound in this one. Outside, Green. Pass to Wiggins. Fires from deep. Wiggins for the triple. Boy, the progression of Wiggins' game out beyond the arc. Now, not only shooting that shot, he's expecting to make it. And so it's the Golden State Warriors closing out this quarter with a seven-point lead. Appearing in control, but could still use a little more of a push to feel totally comfortable in this one. Time for a quick break, then back to the action. And it's time to bring up the State Farm assist to the game. <laughs> yeah, just shredding the defense with that feed. Zero chance to stop that. Yeah, that's just a brilliant read of the defense. I mean, it was also excellent anticipation of the movement of his teammates before the pass. Just great harmony on all sides. Fourth quarter action is upon us. Thanks, as always, for joining us. The Lakers trail on the court for Golden State to start the fourth. Thompson and Wiggins on the wing. Jonathan Kaminga is out there with Dario Saric. And it's Joseph in at the point guard position. Golden State has gotten seven of 12 three-point attempts to fall. Saric, the pass to Joseph. Thompson left side. The 15-footer is good. And the Warriors lead by seven. I really believe we can go ahead now and lock Clay Thompson in on the short list of the greatest pull-up shooters in the NBA. And we might be talking the all-time list here. Prince can't hit. Well, that's finishing the defense there. He made a good effort on that possession defensively and then closed it out with the rebound. And out of bounds, Los Angeles will have it. The Lakers with the ball. James, outside. Outside Russell from deep three-point land. And that one goes. He's shooting five of nine in this one. Whoa, ho, ho. watch out now. And D'Angelo from deep, deep, deep. That's the parking lot range we've heard about for this young man. Launches it. And the Warriors with another three. It's been a dominant night for him. Staying productive throughout. Oh, my! Big time right 
Absolutely. Yeah. Really doesn't matter what position LeBron is playing. The point, the four or the five, James changes games with this pass. Good build. Now a timeout called by Golden State. Well, the value of Jared Vanderbilt as a strong wing defender is pretty undeniable, Clark. You cannot win consistently without players like Jared Vanderbilt. I mean, you need a shutdown defender that has versatility. And it's a skill that he takes a lot of pride in. He's worked at. He brings a lot to the table at that end of the floor. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. During that break, Coach Steve Kerr had some advice for the team. Well, Coach is thrilled with their three-point shooting, saying in the huddle, guys, let's keep it up. Continue to shoot it from deep. It's working. They've been on fire from distance so far. All right, Allie, thanks once again. Gets the three ball to go. And now it's an 11-point Warrior lead. And a look at how the hustle game has been going for the Warriors. I mean, those swats, <laughs> they can get into your head, make you think twice about shooting it. So it's about more than just those block numbers. Boy, I've liked the defensive persistence, hounding the opposition and forcing mistakes as a result coming up with steals, too. The Lakers have got three of six shots to go in this fourth quarter. Pass to James. LeBron, a smooth operator inside. They just look so overwhelmed inside. You know, that's why they continue to get attacked. Yeah, I think they've got to ramp up the aggressiveness. If they don't, things are just going to get worse from here. And just totally relentless, only increasing the intensity level. Yeah, I love the fact he doesn't play the score. He just keeps coming, attack mode. He doesn't know how to step off the gas. Hey, it's James slamming it down. Well, he seems ages at times, guys. Somehow, some way, LeBron continues to rip off these insane sequences time and time again. Stolen by Russell. Boy, the guys on the bench loving every minute of that one. Time called here. The Warriors decide to talk it over. They're ahead by seven. A minute 53 left in the fourth quarter here. And now a moment to present the New Balance player of the game, Clay Thompson. And <laughs> guess what? This was his game all night. I mean, he tore through the defense and almost never took a bad shot out there. Really, a level of offensive consistency most players can only dream of. You can just tell how relieved he is to be playing like this again. Before this, he was weathering a rough patch. But now that is all behind him after this performance. Wiggins outside. Pass to Curry. Shot clock at five. A good-looking shot from the wing. Curry's got seven points for the quarter. Huge night for Curry in a great rhythm thus far. That's always bad news for the team he's facing. The three from Russell. And that bucket makes him 6 for 10 in the contest. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. Oh, wasted no time on that one. Curry's got 14 points here in the second half. This is why you've got to be right up on Curry. Any breathing room he gets is too much. Pass to James. Back to Russell. Here's Davis, wide open. That falls. Nice assist by Russell. AD staring him down, letting him know this ain't over yet. Thompson against Reddish. The three from Curry. The Lakers with a rebound. This is do or die time. They must play flawlessly. In transition, here come the Warriors. Oh, power at home. Oh, wow. The assist from. And they just continue to attack, Thompson. even late in the game, while they're up big. Yeah, well, I don't think you want to get ball. loose and sloppy or ease up, but it is Man. time for them to start yeah. using that clock a bit. Reeves has checked in for yeah. Russell. Oh, look at you, dance team. Okay, everybody, time to get loud. There's 38 seconds dance left team. in the game. Davis Thank finds Reddish. You. Wasted no time with that shot, but it's off the mark. So it's the Warriors now. They're leading by eight. Curry passes to Looney. 
Wiggins for three. Sends it home and from three-point land. Stepping up and nailing an important shot to put this away. And, you know, this run shows what kind of attitude this team has. I mean, the win is there. Go get it. James. And again, the Lakers, no good. Up top, Curry. Checked by Davis. The three. The shot misses. And so Golden State takes this one That's and by a big margin. Game. It ends up being a fairly easy road win. Those are so hard to come by. It's never easy to take a game in someone else's building. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Grant Hill, Ali LaForce, and Clark Kellogg, this is Brian Anderson thanking you all for tuning in tonight. And we'll see you next time.